the last play, was it planned, the pass from LeBron? Huh? Was it, the last play, the pass from LeBron to you, was it planned? Was it what? The play, was it planned, the oh. pass to you? No, I mean, we had nothing planned, you know, we just gonna have him dance in the basket, and, and you know, so I had you know, a smaller guy on me, and I just ducked in and tried to get a problem. AD had to be fitting then for you to end right. things with the games being back in Chicago after 32 oh, years, sure. so it had to feel good to get that oh, one for free sure, throw win. for sure. Um, you know, it was great for us. You know, just to be back home. The new format was amazing. Um, the game was fun. Brings defense back to the game. Brings the excitement back to the game. And uh, we all loved it. And, you know, I'm happy I was able to, you know, be the one to, to knock out a free throw to still get it. With the like new form, with the like new playground basketball in some sense, just how it came down, just how competitive it was. And it feel like in the end, just like playing as a kid in the playground or something like that. And, uh, I feel like playing in the league in the playoff game. <laughs> um, you know, it was it's, it's a great competition, you know, and you know, it's 24 players who, who go out and compete um, at a very high level, and to do it in front of a crowd like this um, with a new format that you know, we were a little skeptical of, just didn't know how it was going to go, and um, you know, everyone in the game was like, they loved it. You know, it bring, like I said, bring about the competition, so um, it, was, it was great. You, you talked about the enjoying the new format. For Laker fans back home, what would you tell them about what this whole weekend was in terms of for COVID? Oh, it meant a lot. Um, like I say, for our side to get a win um, for, for Cole, you know, uh, meant a lot to us. You know, this whole this whole weekend was honoring him, and I think the league you know, did a great job of, of doing that. Um, you know, and congrats to Kawhi on the on the first you know Kobe Bryant MVP trophy. So um, it, it was fun, and you know, I'm glad that you know, we were able to honor him. Each and every way possible. Did you feel the intensity from the kids out there that you were representing oh, the yeah. Chicago Scholars? Because they were putting a lot of you know noise out there yeah, in the crowd. They were putting, sure they were putting pressure on us, <laughs> you know, well, both sides, you know, and it's something for them to enjoy. You know, we wanted to make sure we tried to win every quarter. You know, second got away from us just you know, so we can win for them. You know, and uh, you know they were cheering us on the entire game, so uh, it was real fun. What was it like Thank to celebrate you. with them on the courts after and see their faces? Yeah, it was great. You know, I turned around and you know, they were all there, so. <laughs> Jumping up, jumping up and down, um, you know, shaking our hands and, and congratulating us. So it, it was great to see them. You know, after all the support and everything, we were able to get the win for them and it brought excitement to them. What did you think about just how Chicago hosted? You know, Common's out there with some Khan, celebrities. Yeah, Chicago, Sh Chicago held it down. Uh, they held it down this weekend. Uh, I think they showed the league, showed the league and everyone around the world um, about our Chicago history, um, about uh, the city. Uh, I think everyone enjoyed it and kind of especially kind of a little bit more. Do you think about the game? Is always your opinion about the new format? What? The new format, your, your opinion? Oh, it was great. Uh, like I said, we, we loved it. Uh, it. It brings the competition back, you know, especially in the, in the fourth quarter. So, um, you know, it's, it's about just get stops. You know, you have to get stops to win a game. And, you know, it was. It was great. We all loved it. Would you put this as an all-time classic? Do you consider this an all-time classic? Absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, for the seven I've been in, I think this is you know, probably one of the, the better ones. Um, like I said, we were actually out there competing. You know, we were arguing with the refs. You know, it, was just like a, it felt like a real playoff game. You know, and uh, that's what makes it fun. Was Last two questions, please. Was the climax winning it with a free throw? Huh? Wasn't it anti-climax winning the game with a free throw? Well, did I win a game with a free throw? Yeah, you would prefer to make a winning shot, right? Not a free throw. I don't know what you're saying. He's asking if it was anticlimactic that it ended in a free throw uh, after it was uh, supposed to. I mean, hey, we just got we try to get whatever we do to get the win. You know, they, they shouldn't have fouled me. Uh, you know, Joel and B was trying to say that we you know we shouldn't be able to win on a free throw, but hey, that wasn't in the rule book, so. Um, yeah, we just got the win. How much emotion did you have for uh, the tribute beforehand with Jennifer Hutchins and Magic? Oh, yeah, I mean, it's very emotional. I think, you know, both of them did a great job in, in honoring Kobe. Uh, you know, Common as well. You know, I think, like I said, the entire weekend was great, you know, and just honoring him and his legacy. And, um, you know, obviously, our jerseys, uh, both teams for him and his daughter. You know, I think the NBA did a, a wonderful, wonderful job of, of continuing, continuing his legacy in, in the All-Star game. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.